number 68, identify the type of crystalline solid, whether it's a metallic, network covalent, ionic, or molecular crystalline solid that's formed by each of the following substances, and in this case we have NH3 as our substance, which is ammonia. Now does ammonia, uh, when ammonia freezes from a liquid to a solid, what type of solid does it make? Metallic, network covalent, ionic, or molecular? Well, let's figure it out. I wrote down some good tricks down here to memorize uh, for your test or quiz coming up, if this material is on it, to just identify the difference between those crystalline solids. So let's get started. I guess we'll start from left to right. Would NH3 be a metallic crystalline solid? Well, metallic, the word metal, is in the word metallic. So in order to be a metallic crystalline solid, you should just have a single metal. No nonmetals here. But if I look on the periodic table, nitrogen is a nonmetal. And hydrogen is also a nonmetal. So I don't have any metals here in ammonia. Ammonia is a covalent compound. So can't be metallic. Let's move on. Would this be an ionic crystalline solid? Well, ionic crystalline solids come from ionic compounds all the way back in the day, in the beginning of chem, when we learned ionic co compounds. Remember, an ionic compound is between a metal and a nonmetal, or if you start seeing polyatomics. But once again, have no uh, metals here, and I don't spot out any polyatomics. So can't be ionic. Let's move on. Is it a molecular crystalline solid? Well, molecular crystalline solids come from covalent compounds, because whenever you say the word molecule, molecule means that you have a covalent compound. And covalents are all nonmetals. I got nonmetal. I got a nonmetal. So this could be a molecular crystalline solid. Let's just make sure that it's not the network covalent. Now, network covalent crystalline solid is basically the same as a metallic crystalline solid just swapped. Metallic crystalline solids are just a single metal. Network covalents are just a single nonmetal. I have two different nonmetals here. I have nitrogen and hydrogen, so that's out. Just know that you could also have a network covalent um, crystalline solid if you start seeing silicon, which is SI. But no silicon here, so network covalent is out. This would be a molecular crystalline solid. And this video is done. Let's box it off. Make it the nice blue. Love this blue. And let's put it in the middle. And we're good to go. I hope this helped you out. Thank you so much for viewing the video. Subscribe to the channel if you want to help us out. Like the video. Um, you know, and... Thank you so much. Really, really do appreciate you guys coming to the channel. And we're so glad that we could help you out with your school, your schoolwork. We also have physics and math videos on the channel. So go check it out. All right. Thanks for being part of this community. You guys rock. I'll talk to you soon. Okay. Bye-bye.